Good morning guys, welcome to What I Eat Wednesday. I had coffee already um, with a whole bunch of almond milk and then it made it actually kind of cold, but that's okay. Um, so for breakfast, I'm going to be making some eggs, scrambled eggs, I think. And then my mom, when I was at her house on when, or not Wednesday, on Sunday, um, she was like, oh, I got this, but I don't like it. So, or it's too processed, which I guess. Um, so it's the Eve's veggie bacon strips. I don't think I've ever had this. Maybe? No, I've had like tempeh bacon, but, or like cake bacon, but anyways, so we're gonna try this because mom didn't want it, so she so might as well have it, and since it's open, might as well use it. So we're gonna make scrambled eggs and veggie bacon, and then today we have to carve pumpkins. Yay! <laughs> it looks like bacon. Well, maybe not looks like it, but it's like bobbling and greasy like bacon. <laughs> All right, so it is done. It looks more like sweet potato <laughs> strips or something, but we'll see what they taste like. Actually, they're pretty good. Hmm. I will let you know what Dan thinks of them. Mm. I don't know if it's like bacon, but it's like, uh, I don't know, like a snack. I guess bacon could be a snack, but like, it's like a fruit leather, but a spicy fruit. <laughs> mm, very good. And the eggs, I put a lot of spice in it, um, as well as red pepper flakes. Mm, those are all good. All right, I'm gonna have this, and I'll let you know what Dan thinks of that veggie, weird veggie bacon. Dan says he's pretty impressed too. It actually does taste a little bit like bacon. <laughs> So we're gonna be roasting pumpkin seeds. So, just going to try to save as many seeds as I can before I start carving. I'm gonna be roasting my pumpkin seeds now, just with the two pumpkins. Dan hasn't carved his yet, so, um, well, I've just hollowed mine out. They're still just drying over there, but I haven't, well, I haven't carved it. But I'm gonna get started with this. I'm baking them at 300 degrees Fahrenheit for 45 minutes. I know you can do 350 for like 20 minutes, but, we're doing that and we're going with two different types so we're doing a sweet and a savory um, the savory is just your typical sea salt um, and then the sweet I'm gonna do some sugar as well as some cinnamon together so first off I have some melted butter so going to pour that on this and it's gonna be hot actually so I should use a spatula not my hands as I usually do I'm just mixing that in Actually, it's not that hot. All right, so then half of it I'm gonna put in another container. How much? Oh, we'll do more savory. About the same amount of savory. I'm just putting some salt in. And then the sweet. I don't think I'll need this much sugar, but just the sugar as well as some cinnamon. I feel almost silly showing this, like, just <laughs> sprinkle a little bit on. But anyway, I've only always had, like with salt, I've never actually had cinnamon ones, so I thought that'd be something interesting to try. And then I have my baking tray with a little divider in the middle. And I did, just did with aluminum foil. So we're putting them separately. That's my salt one. I don't know, it should be like a thin, single layer. Eh, kind of close. And then my sugar one. Now, off to bake. It's been 45 minutes and the salt ones seem done. I'm not sure why they're half brown, half not, but that's okay. But then the sugar ones are still, you can see this, maybe they had too much butter in that one. Um, or I guess, well, I don't know, the sugar's melting. So those ones aren't crispy yet, so they have to go in. I'm gonna leave them in a little bit more. So I'm just gonna take these ones out and then keep that one in for another like five minutes or so. All right, so everything is all done. Pumpkins are done and pumpkin seeds are done. I don't have lights in them, but I did my typical schnauzer as well as then this one. It'll look better when it's lit up, but three pumpkins stacked on top. 
Um, that's still a little too wide. It would make more sense if it was like, oh, well, I'm not gonna switch it. Um, and then our pumpkin seeds, we've already been snacking. So that's the one with um, salt on it. And then the sugar and cinnamon ones, they kind of clump together. They are so good. I think Dan and I both like these ones a little more now. Mmm. Mm. Of course, no doubt for me because I like sweet more than salty, but he's a salty person, so. Mmm. I could just eat these all day, but I won't. Mm -hmm. It is one o'clock now, so we're gonna make some lunch and then get ready to go. For lunch, we are having leftovers from yesterday. Dan made a mac and cheese bake. Uh, well, I guess not mac. It has penne um, and then with some breadcrumbs on top. Um, super high in calories, but very good. Because I used to not have a lot of cheese, but then ever since we found the President's Choice Vegetarian Cheese made with non-animal rennet, now we're having, having so much cheese again because before I was like, well, I can't eat cheese, but now I'm like, I found a cheese I can eat that's vegetarian. Um, so of course cheese is super fattening. So like we try to only have small portions of this, especially because it's like one serving is a lot of calories, but it's so delicious. So yeah, that's what we're having for lunch today. I am getting ready to go teaching now. So my tea, that's just Finishing up steeping is the David's Tea Glitter and Gold. It's a black tea with, I think, some lemon peel, as well as golden stars. I don't know if you can see. Ah, no, you can't. Oh, there's some stuff in there that's starry. Let's trace. Pretty good. All right, I am gonna take the stringer out of it, though. <laughs> But yeah, so um, it's a long day. Where did I put my apple? Oh, there it is. Um, I have a teacher's meeting. We're already deciding Christmas stuff um, after, so I'll only be home around eight. Uh, so having an apple, I think one of the other teachers are bringing um, like cheese and crackers, but eating crackers on their own aren't as good. So I'm gonna have my apple before, like right before the meeting. Um, yeah, as well as my tea. So I'll see you guys in the evening for dinner. I'm back home from work. It is super late. Our meeting was late. Well, this was a quarter to nine. That's what I'm having dinner, but oh well. So thankfully Dan made dinner for us. We are having curry, which is something that I thought I was gonna be home at like eight or 8.15, but you know, so anyways, that's nice that someone could just simmer on the stove for a bit. So we have lots of kale. So it was a kale and tofu curry, and we've already taken what we're having out. So, um, yeah, and then it's over top of just, I think it's jasmine rice. Let's try it. Oh, I will take the one with the more kale. I think that one's for me. It's super hot. Mmm. Good flavor though. Yes. So, this is what I'm gonna have, but oh, I will show you our pumpkins because throughout the day I have been snacking on the two different types of seeds. Plus, I may have some more after. Um, but yeah, I'll show you what the pumpkins are. Here are the pumpkins now that they're lit up. So the schnauzer one. Yeah. And then, yeah, I'm still not happy with the top one. You can, it's not pumpkin shape, but the rest are pretty good. Just, just snacking on some of the pumpkin seeds. I definitely like the sweet ones better, um, but the salty ones are good too. I wonder what it would be like with, um, coconut oil instead of butter. Mmm. Mm. All good. <laughs> That's gonna be it today. I hope everyone has a fun and safe Halloween and I will see you guys next week. Bye!